that tray will be known as the new 12.9 inch iPad Pro. But all jokes aside, this is Apple's new iPad, the Pro series. But it's a lot bigger, but how's the durability when subjected to drops from various heights and various angles? One. <laughs> It's a lot of noise. And I don't know what material I was using in this book. It looks pretty good, so still good. And this thing has a lot of mass. So once we start dropping it on its side or face down, I don't see this thing surviving for very long. One. lot of mass this glass man it won't last for very long but this does have more of a border than the iPhones do so maybe it will be a little bit more durable oh my gosh oh my goodness well that's it right there the screen didn't crack but man so that <laughs> experience quite a glitch iOS 9 man this is such a buggy release Apple can fix this <laughs> Wow, so that's all it took, but the glass didn't crack, hey? Yeah, this uh, new LCD technology in order to accommodate the Apple Pencil might be more brittle. That's just a rear impact. So, man, that's, uh, that's quite interesting. So six feet is all it takes to break this thing. The display is starting to dim. The colors are looking strange, and all this glitching when I actually <laughs> start playing with it. So it actually looks like one of the layers of the display has stopped working. Uh, it's really strange. It's such an interesting 3D effect. So that multi-layered LCD that makes uh, the Apple Pencil work. Using iPad Pro 12.9 inch pen test or attempted pen test. I'm not that strong, but I'll give it my best shot. So here we go. Ooh, three, two, one. displays a little bit functioning up here. I can see some icons down here, but it's unresponsive. 